as I watch what's going on today with the Michael Brown case and the case in Ferguson, I can't help but notice one thing that keep occurring in alternative media and the mainstream media. It's this narrative that these people are acting like animals, destroying their own city, destroying other people's property. And I want you to look at this video. Look at these photos. This is what other people do when they happy. When they team won the World Series or the Stanley Cup. Now, I could have used more videos, I could uh, or photos, I could have used uh, World Cup, and you would have saw all kind of violence and destruction of property. So to label these people in Ferguson who's hurting, who are tired of their black men being killed by police one every 28 hours. Men that are unarmed are being murdered. And they upset. And they destroy property. And they rioting because no one's listening. To call them animals. When other races destroy property. When they're happy. They team won a championship. No. They're not animals. They're acting human. They're frustrated. You just don't get it. When have you ever seen an animal blew the building? Or flip a police car and set it on fire? That's another race baiting tactic. And even the alternative media is doing it. Even Alex Jones, who I admire, and I've listened to her for four years, who woke me up to a lot of information. Don't seem to get it. Now he might he might be telling the truth when he said he don't see cover. And he didn't mean to put the terrorist label on a black face. But he did it. Because he don't seem to understand one key factor. He can choose to not see color. But if I choose that, as soon as I walk out my door, there'll be somebody there to remind me I'm black. Think about that, America.